Hello everyone, Goblin J here, and finally welcome back to Kingdom Hearts 3. Um, so I started playing this when it first came out, on the channel at least. I, I beat it like a week after it came out, <laughs> um, and I never played it on the channel again. So um, Remind comes out today, so I decided, hey, why not play replay Kingdom Hearts when Remind comes out? Cause why not? So I'm not starting the series over again. I'm starting exactly from the last one. In the last episode, we left uh, Olympus and we're making our way towards uh, Twilight Town, which we're already at. Also, sorry if I'm loud at times. Uh, the my headphones are like super loud. No matter how I'm, I'm trying, I'm putting them low, but like you know, I don't want to put them too low. Continue game. <clears throat> also, Oathkeeper comes out for free today as well. So that's going to be super fun to play with. Twilight Town. Gorge, we forgot to fill Master Yen Sid in on what happened. Should we go back? Hmm. You mean about Maleficent and Zigbar? No. The others have already got enough on their plates as it is. Why go stressing them out? The three of us know how to handle a couple of old adversaries, right? Yeah, but doesn't that thing Pete said bother you? The black box? Come on, we're talking about Pete. That means it's probably no big deal. Oh, I don't know. Oh, cool! The trams are still here! So, uh, it been that long. Feels like it. Maybe you're feeling what Roxas feels because he misses home. Mm hmm. Actually, I ran into Roxas in the Sleeping Worlds. It was like seeing into his heart for the first time. And he was in the dinosaur, too. Uh-huh. It was a test to see if your data version was ready to face the hurt that you carry inside. Was I ready? I do know hurt. When I lost Riku and Kairi, and later when I lost the Keyblade, and you guys had to go on without me like that? Having no one to turn to was the worst kind of hurt. But that just shows how much you mean to me. Carrying around a little hurt can't be all that bad. Hurting is part of caring. Of course. Any Sora is still Sora. So wait. If Roxas feels something, then we're in the right place. Roxas, I'm gonna find you. Huh? Probably should have read that. Read this shot. Nobodies! Nobodies! <gasps> Lynx. Lynx are magical manifestations of Sora's friends that he can summon to his side. Use them to select Link from the command menu. Lynx require a full MP gauge to use, and you reduce your MP to zero. In exchange, the friend you summon will restore your team's HP. Lynx. Meow Wow Balloon. Press circle to bound into the air and inflate Meow Wow one side at a time. Press X to deflate and barrel into the enemy. Yeah. Give me strength! My, my favorite thing about 3 is that it definitely, like, okay. it really just brought all the games together and just, like, yeah. had a little bit of everything. And that's, like, it's, it's definitely my favorite like, yeah. out of all the games now, you know? It used to be 2. It used to be 2. But, like, you know, after, like, playing this for hours on end, it's just like, oh, man, this is great, you know? And finish. <laughs> Oops. Yeah. Yeah. Strike 
You know, these keyblades are cool and all, but I'm gonna be... I'm not gonna use them, honestly. Yeah, I don't. God, he's just dashes. Yeah, I can't touch me. Where do you at though? Where the rest of them? Just yeah. ah, the map. Map of the neighborhood. Okay, so where's the rest? Did I break the game? I hear them fighting. Donald, where are you? Oh, there you are. There we go. <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute, you're really fighting. <laughs> oh, man. Hmm. What was that voice? I know I heard it. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come from? Get the ice cream later. Oh. What? Hold up. See? Voices. Uh. New ones? <laughs> what? Hainer? Pence? Olette? Hey, it's Ethan. Oh, what is that? <laughs> Hey, Sora! Hello, goodbye! Uh, oh. Go! We got this! Demon Tower, I right. I don't know what I mean this one. Demon Tide, I was close. God, when I saw this, I, I, now I'm reminiscing about the first trailer again. I remember seeing this thing in like one of the first trailers. I was like, I can't wait to fight that. That's all I cared about during that first trailer. Here we go. All right, I don't have aerial recovery. Oh yeah. Also, I switched from the uh, Xbox to PlayStation. It just felt weird. You know. Considering, like, um, all the other games are gonna be from Sony PlayStation games, you know, PlayStation stuff. Like, well, so we should be as well. Also, yeah, I'm not gonna stop uh, playing the rest of the games. I'm still gonna go through all of them eventually. Oh, that's cheating. Ah. Uh, Uh, hey Donald, you might want to heal me. Help, <laughs> Donald. Thank you. There we go. Your.
Nice fighting. Thanks, Sora. Painter, Pence, Olette, it's been ages. What? It hasn't been that long. Yes, hey. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? You kidding, uh. Pence? When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? It's not weird. This is underprecedented. Hmm, I guess it is. The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to sleuthing. We are already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. Which is? Well, actually, we're looking for Roxas. Roxas? That's funny. I don't know any Roxas, mm. but the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. That's one way to put it. Actually, he might have been friends with another version of you. Hmm? This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh, yeah, the other Twilight Town. It's like one of those spot the differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Sure, he seems like a pretty cool guy. <laughs> yeah, he is. Great, then let's all go ask around town. If alternate us knew Roxas, then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm -hmm. Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. The three of us will cover places in town. Thanks. Oh yeah, I got this phone thingy that takes pictures. <laughs> Wanna snap a photo while we're all here? Sure, that's a great idea. <laughs> hmm? Wait, who's taking it? Oh. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Why do I have to do it? Hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. It's okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? <laughs> Everybody smile! <laughs> wow! That came out great! Oh, a lucky emblem! Lucky emblem? Oh yeah, they are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. And if you get a picture of them, they'll bring you good luck. Cool! <laughs> Wait, look guys, is that... <laughs> You're right! I see it too! <laughs> I knew it! Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay, we better start asking around. You start by checking out the old mansion. We'll catch up. Got it. Taking photos. Press the touchpad to take out the gummy phone camera. Photos you take are saved to your album, which you can access by opening the main menu and selecting gummy phone photo album. You can save up to 200 photos. Select game help from the main menu to learn more about the camera controls. A single save data can hold anywhere from 20 to 200 photos, depending on how many photos are saved elsewhere. If you cannot save the maximum 200, delete photos from your album and other saved data to make space. The gummy phone will automatically detect any lucky emblems or other noteworthy subjects in frame and display a hit indicator. The hit indicator will turn yellow if you are shooting at the correct angle and distance, or red if the distance or angle is wrong. The icon will also appear in the lower right to tell you what's being detected. The neighborhood! Let's see! And technically speaking, you do have to shoot it, because... Whatever. Um... 
I know this is gonna be one of the photos. Let's see. Hey. Yeah, I caught you. I caught you. Let's see. Yep. You want a picture of me? Okey dokey. Right, we took it. We just got some super special gummy blocks in stock. Super special gummy blocks. Uh, yeah, I don't want to spend too much you money. Check out the old mansion. Yes, sir. I, I, I just want to talk to the Moogle. <laughs> the Keyblade Forge. While you're at the workshop, you can spend synthesis materials to power up your Keyblades, increasing your strength and magic stats, and unlocking new abilities. If you're struggling with the enemies ahead, powering up your Keyblade could be a solution. <laughs> Photo missions. As creative as, the, as creative as the Moogles are, sometimes they need a burst of inspiration to come up with new items. Travel the world and bring back photos of the subjects the Moogles tells you about, and you'll be rewarded with brand new synthesis with recipes. The synthesis materials you collected will be left here at the workshop. Collector's goal complete. You have locked new items to synthesize. Collector's goal complete. We will hand over a hungry shard. Uh, hungry stone. Any mitts. Uh, water core and flame core. Easy peasy. Not really a lot of synthesize right now, but that's fine. Keyblade Forge! Um, Hero's Origin. Definitely. Not a fluorite. Nice. The best way to get fluorite is, um... Eventually you can synthesize it, but the best way to actually get the stuff is, uh... Do gummy stuff. Yeah, you gotta destroy rocks in the gummy worlds. In the gummy... map. Or whatever. The, wor the world map! <laughs> You know what I'm trying to say. And yep, yeah, that's really all I can do right now. I'm not gonna go crazy with, with stuff, but I do want to, like, you know. Make sure that I'm, uh, prepared for stuff. Water cuff link, fire bangle potion. I don't trust Go Donald. Okay, we're good. Also, don't forget to equip new abilities. MP safety, disable recharging when MP runs out, only cure magic and the commands will trigger a recharge. Healing items on magic and friends. Come I, I didn't mean to do that. Combo plus, magic combo drift. Treasure magnet. Alright. Uh customize. Got some magic, got some links. Yeah, I'm just gonna go through all this because I don't it's gonna annoy me if I don't. Don't necessarily I need to, but you know. Nobody's uh, character files. It just makes me feel better when I do do this, you know. Like sure I can leave it alone, but also I'm gonna be playing this for like a good minute, so it's like, uh let's go through everything here. Make sure I give them their new stuff. Huh, I know I'm wasting time. I know, I'm sorry. I just can't help it. Yeah, I hovered. Oh, oh, oh. Aha! Thank you, game. I don't think I necessarily need to have done that, but you know what? Okay, I feel so much better now. I feel so much better now. Uh, so much better. Also, my save data is here. I'm just hiding it because, like, I'm at endgame right now, so... I mean... People have already probably seen it by now, I imagine. But, like, you know, just in case. Don't want to spoil it. Maybe spoil too much, you know? Yeah. There's one here. Let's see. So, 
Uh, there's one here. Let's see. Somewhere. Oh yeah, it's when the the video stops playing. So. Oh hey, Donald, you're here too. You can do it. <laughs> Sora, please. I'm, I love the fact that that's a thing. I don't know if they're gonna say anything. If I, if I just... Let's see. <laughs> huh? Is there some kind of blotch up there on the screen? Yeah, it's me. But also, there is. Yes. <laughs> I think we're getting warm. What a prick. Nope, I would like to jump up here. Oh yeah, another one. And yeah, I'm not gonna go for all of them, but I will be going for like as many as I can because you do get stuff for it. You know, stuff that's to like just handy overall, you know, just handy overall stuff. Alright, I can upgrade the keyblade again. So we have to go yeah. Where else are we gonna go? Working on it. Counter shield. Let's go. Man, this game is so pretty. Sometimes I'm just playing it, I don't even notice it, but like, man, this game is so freaking pretty. Yep. And there's another one over here somewhere. There's one right here on the door. Let's see. There's hey, one up I here. think that's a lucky emblem. Let's see. Experts ring. I'll have to save that for later. But yeah, it's like super handy to actually go for some of them yeah. because like, you know, you get items. Have him surrounded. Oh no! Yeah. He's my favorite heartless man. Here we go. Ooh, level up. Man, I would like to know where I'm going. Man, I would like to know what I'm looking at. <laughs> it's over. Nice. I'm, I'm glad, like, instead of adding new the, of old abilities from the old games, they actually like kept it in as attacks. And I love that so much. Like a minor spoiler for uh, one of Old Keeper's combo attacks is Zazen Suskin. I can't even say it right now. No, I'll never say it right. Nice. 
I'm still low key salty that you unlock that keep this keyblade later on. Like, like, I, I, I mean, not not in the sense that it's not fair. Because like, I, the way I unlocked this keyblade was I actually played Kingdom Hearts Unchained. Well, take care. Cutscene. to pick up the fruit for him. Mm, okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit? Right then. So, what are you gonna do with all this anyway? gonna cook it well okay you be careful going home see you around yeah like I'm a little salty cuz I I played through action. the I played through the game and I did all the mini games on the, the um, unchained X to unlock this keyblade sure seemed happy and then it's like oh hey here you go! You unlock it by progressing through the story! And I'm just sitting here like, bruh. I also did it for the competition to have your um name in the game, and I didn't even win that either. So I was like, ah, oh, that's a double heavy hit, man. <laughs> I, I'm actually low-key a little salty about that to this day, because I really put in a lot of time and effort into Kingdom Hearts Unchained X to get my name into Kingdom Hearts 3, and like, no. <laughs> I was so sad about that, man. I mean, even if you... Well, okay, spoiler. Even if it's, like, going too fast for you to be able to even see the name, I don't care. To have your name in Kingdom Hearts 3, it's like... That would have been so cool, you know? I'm rambling, though. I'm rambling. Yeah. But yeah, I'm, I'm just more over salty about the fact that I put in all that time and effort. Because <laughs> I really wanted it, because I didn't know if it was going to be like, you would have to pay for it. Like, uh, this Keyblade I'm using right now. Or if it was going to be like a pre-order thing, where like, uh, you pre-order and then you can unlock this Keyblade. I didn't know how it was going to work. You know? So I did it anyway. Oh, man. I mean, it must be nice having your name in the game when you paid for it. <laughs> you know? Let's face it, a lot of whales. It was primarily just whales who got their name into, into this game through, through Unchained X. And like, I know there's only like one person who probably be like, Oh yeah, I remember that. That took me hours. Because yeah, it did take hours. It took me hours as well. You know, I'm just, I'll forever be salty about that. No lie. Do you? Go get yeah, you do all the work, Luffy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen. Water. I see it. That building up ahead. The old mansion. Ah, uh, this brings back memories.
What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, they do say that this mansion is haunted. <laughs> but you've been here before. Hey there. <gasps> ah! <sighs> Thanks for the heart attack. Oh, what? Did I scare you? Uh, oh. Our bad. So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope. Afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. Does it really, though? Does it really? Here we go! The password was, uh, sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, I'm in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh. Oh man, the transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then, and this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. But, huh? Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah, but how'd you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know any slug. Oh, oh, and what? You do? Hold out. <laughs> I know I haven't got a clue. <laughs> then, uh, who was it that logged in? Oh, uh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup, but I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so I uh, can't run it. Which program? The uh, transporter to the other Twilight Town. Uh, it's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... Ah, right, we need his address. <laughs> Sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh... Basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. I can't computer, so do that. Glad you're following along. 
Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chip and Dale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. He was recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh... I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah, see ya, Hainer. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye! <laughs> oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pence. <laughs> hey! Hmm. <laughs> oh, <yo. laughs> well, you heard him. No pretzel. Yeah, this part is definitely like cutscenes or us. Hey, we have control back. Return to the town. Oh, so, what's next? Want to go back? Yes, I do. Let's go. So, you think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. Oh. Ansem! Semnus! Roxas should never have existed in the first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Do you even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just Data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside Data. There are hearts all around us. Hmm. Huh? Ansem and Zemnis used to be part of the same person, right? But look, now they exist separately just fine. Mm. If they can do it, then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah! Yeah! You tell him, Captain Goofy! <laughs> In that case, by all means. Nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. You wish? He'll never answer to you again! Still so blind. A nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness, there is only one way to bring Roxas back. Which is for you to give your heart up as well. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> what? Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <gasps> Neo Shadow. And nobody. <sighs> now. Set your heart free. Wait! Uh, Sora! Uh, it's not darkness. Not if it helps him. Uh, 
I love it. Gameplay into cutscene. I mean, cutscene into gameplay. I love it. Also, Zemnis. Oh, the silky smooth voice, man. I love it. Horse! Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. Herc said, he said, with all my heart, okay, then all my heart it is, I'm getting Roxas out, are you with me, Donald, Goofy, huh? you want to, you. I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. Okay then, let's head back to town. <laughs> okay, we'll do that in the next video. Because I'm out of time, technically speaking. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. Whew. And yeah, I will be playing Remind after um, we beat Kingdom Hearts 3. So I'm definitely going to see if like, eventually I'll, I will make the episodes longer, but I don't want them to, like, hit an hour, so that's why I'm ending the video here. Because I know that if I, like, go any longer, it's just going to be like, ah, oh, well. It's going to go over the hour. But then again, I don't really know if I want to do that per se, but I, I do eventually, you know, want to get around to, you know, it or whatever. I don't know what I'm trying to say here. <laughs> Anyways. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Please. It helps. Please. <laughs> see you awesome, everyone. Laters.